Welcome to the latest episode of the Get in the Know video series. Today's video will help you avoid getting scammed by spotting the red flags of fraud. Fraudsters will say anything to get your money, but you can protect yourself by recognizing the common red flags of fraudulent investment pitches. Here are some things to watch for. If someone pressures you to buy an investment, be suspicious. Take your time to review the investment opportunity and consider talking with an objective third party, someone who can help you investigate the offering and the person selling it. All investments carry risk. Be suspicious of anyone who guarantees a certain investment return. Legitimate investments generally do not guarantee income or a return on your investment. Know the risk level you are taking and invest only what you are willing and can afford to lose. Is someone promising you unrealistic returns on your investment? Any investment that provides remarkably high or consistently positive returns, regardless of the market's condition, should raise suspicion. Many investment scams involve unlicensed individuals selling unregistered investment products. Your local securities regulator can help determine if the product has been registered for sale and if the person is licensed or registered to sell securities in your jurisdiction. You should understand with any investment strategy you're considering what it is, what the risks are, and how it expects to make money. Be cautious of highly complex investing techniques or products you don't understand. Securities regulators require, with some exceptions, that investors be given disclosure documents that explain the investment opportunity, including information about who is selling it, the risks involved, and how the investment works. If someone tries to sell you a security with no documentation, they may be selling risky unregistered securities that aren't suitable for you, or worse, something completely bogus. Be sure to ask for documentation and verify with independent third party or with your local securities regulator if you have concerns. If a person demands that you pay them directly to participate in the investment, don't do it. Legitimate investments should not require you to pay money directly to the person sponsoring the investment. Once a fraudster has your money, you may not be able to get it back. Unauthorized trades, missing funds, or other problems with your investment account could be the result of a genuine error or could indicate fraud. Always read your account statements and ask questions if you see a problem or if something you don't understand. If you stop getting statements, statements are inconsistent, or they look altered, take action and investigate the discrepancies. If you suspect fraud or think you may be a victim, contact your local securities regulator. For more information on the red flags of fraud, visit NASA's Fraud Center.